Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel CAD Engineer. In this video, we are going to learn how to use Use Reference option in Linear Pattern. So here you can see this part we have made by using Use Reference Pattern option. So let's see how to do that. So here we have this part body, the extrude cut feature that we are going to do a pattern. So here we are going to select this extrude cut feature to do a pattern. We'll go to Linear Pattern. Now here we have to select in the option up to references. So first we'll specify the direction in which direction we are going to do pattern for that. I'll specify this edge. Now we have to specify the reference face. So here I'll specify this reference face. In the reference we can select faces, axis or planes to specify the directions. Now we'll specify the second direction. For that we'll select this edge. Now we have to specify up to the reference of the face we are making that. So I'll select this face. Now let's understand how we can control a pattern here. In first direction we have one option here offset distance. So if you want to maintain a offset distance from this reference you can specify the value of offset. So I'll give here 2. So what we can see here once we have defined the 2 offset the number of count has been reduced and it just moved 10 distance away from that. Next, you have one more thing here, the spacing. If you want to control the spacing between two objects, you can specify here. Right now, we have spacing 2 mm. So let me specify that to be 1.5 mm. You can see the number of count has been increased. So according to how much space is available, software automatically adjusts the counts. Now, I'll just make this to be 0 and we'll specify this to be 2. Now, we'll go to the second direction. Again, here if you want to control the offset from that face, we can specify, I said I want to take an offset of 5mm from that face. So software has left it 5mm space from that face. Now, I want to control that spacing between them. So here I can control the spacing, I said that to be 1.5. So number of count has been become 10 according to that particular space. Now again, I'll go to this, I'll just make this count to be 0. You see. The number of count become 13 and the 1.5 distance. Now I want to make total 10 objects so we can calculate how much distance we can take here. So I'll put it 2 distance and we can see the total count is 10 here. So this is how we can specify use reference method. We can control the distance between the objects and the offset distance from the faces. So this is how we can use use reference pattern method. Thank you for watching this video.